Bucci. I am a physics major. I'm Patty Massa and I'm studying nanomedicine. Hi, I'm Ben Tidd. I'm studying electron beam lithography here with Professor Hartley. My name is Jen Baxter and I'm studying the inhibition of bacterial biofilms. This summer I was focusing on uh, targeted drug delivery systems for cancer cell treatment of solid brain tumors and um, I was given a clinical case report that had um, symptoms of a patient, medical history, and a physical exam, and I went through and pretty much just ciphered it and broke it down and came up with a diagnosis for them and treatment and how nanomedicine would improve the diagnosis and treatment process. Well, I don't know if you can see it in the camera, but there's a bunch of wires here, so when I came here, there's a huge coil that's all tangled up, and for safety reasons, through the building and everything, we had to take everything apart, rewire it. We had to buy some uh, tracks, put separate DC and AC from signal cables. And so this is good for me, For if I ever work out in the real industry, I know what has to be done for safety reasons. Specifically, we're looking at um, orally associated bacteria. So these are the bacteria that can cause dental caries and gingivitis in your mouth. And so we're trying to find some compounds that inhibit this growth of bacterial biofilms because the biofilms are very hard to break apart when they're in this structure. I get to see both this organic chemistry lab, I get to build polymers, but then I also get to come here and help design vacuum chambers. Each project has its own unique flavor and its own unique objectives in any, of the, any number of the constellations. So in nanobioscience, we focus mostly on nanotechnology applications in the life sciences, and my group particularly focuses on medical applications for the summer interns. Um, the projects are unique and they're also pretty intense. I just wanted to see what it was all about because I'm considering it for grad school, so basically getting included in it all is a good trial run to get to see what's going on. It's a great mentoring experience. We've actually gotten uh, several of our interns uh, from this program who have decided to pursue a graduate degree uh, at CNSC. Uh, and so really it's, it's a great way for me to evaluate students and really encourage them to take the next step and pursue graduate school. It's a great opportunity to be able to learn so much about working in a laboratory and I get a lot of hands-on experience that I wouldn't have been able to have if I wasn't a part of this program. The project we're working on with, uh, I'm working on with Ben this summer is this machine here uh, is an e-beam lithography system and when Ben arrived um, about six weeks ago now, it was parts spread across the lab. So under my direction, Ben has been putting this together. I don't know how many other kids around the country can say they've worked on something like this. There aren't many of these around, I'm sure. And so to have that on my resume is a great honor, and I'm proud of it. Being here, I've, I've grown so much and learned learned so much. No matter what I do, this has been a very valuable experience, and I've learned a lot. They were talking about how fast it went this summer, like all the other interns. And like none of us want it to be over. Anyone that sees this, definitely apply. It's very competitive and it's a great experience.